You already know what I'm doing. So, today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys all these friendship bracelets that I've made. Um, so, I started making friendship bracelets. I'm not going to show you guys the first batch. When I went to the Aero store a couple of months ago, earlier in the year, I made a few friendship bracelets, but they were all really, really bad. And you guys are not. That was probably too loud and I'm probably going to have to cut that, but let's hope for not having to cut it. So, I'm going to make these lights white, this way you can kind of see the colors. So, okay, I actually was wearing this one today. A piece of paper in there that's being annoying. So, I'm going to a festival, a music festival, in a few days. And I made bracelets relating to artists, like the songs, the artists that are going to be there and like their songs and the lyrics and all that. So this one is from a Boy Genius song called Revolution, no, not Revolution Zero, I'm such a liar, from their song Satanist. And this is You Wonder. They're all gonna be flipped because I'm filming with my front camera. It's fine. And so I used these little like grayish silver beads and these orange ones and then I have like purple in between. Yeah. So that's my first one. This one was the first bracelet I made. Well, the first one I made that didn't completely fall apart. This is the first one I made that's still intact. Um, this is Exile. This is for Taylor Swift. Because I'm going to the Aero store in the new year. But that's good. Um, and so I made this one for her as well. Her name is Epic Swift. Well, she's not a big Swifty, but she's a big fan of Exile. She's a pretty big fan of Taylor, but not huge. Um, yeah, so I have gray and blue. And I have gold beads. I really like this one. Um, okay. And so I have a bracelet for Ethel Kane. This is one of her songs. have these purple and blue beads. They look kind of probably too similar. And then black beads. So it's not really focusing on you. Let's see if I can try to get it to focus. Come on. Yeah, it's not gonna focus. And then in between I have this like fun multicolored bead. It's like blue, black, and white. Okay, I've only done three bracelets so far and it's already been five minutes, so I'm gonna try to speed through these. 
maybe I'll do I'll do half no I can't do half because I'm not gonna know which ones I did okay I'll just I'll just speed through <laughs> sorry okay this is also for boy genius this is PB for Phoebe Bridgers LD for Lucy Vegas and JB for Jolene Baker I have blue green and yellow alternating pattern and then just little black beads in the spaces this one is another Ethel Kane one this says it's green it says I heart Willoughby Tucker um if you've listened to Preacher's Daughter you know House in Nebraska um okay actually I'm gonna save this one for the end I'm gonna save some of my favorites for the end okay this one is for Lana Del Rey this is Florida Kilo. It's, I'm not having a hard time reading. I'm just camera quality is not so awesome right now. Probably should have made it nicer before starting. And then I just have like these like black holographic big beads, and then I have a purple one here. And then a clear one and another purple one <laughs> sorry um this one's another Lana Del Rey one this is referenced a couple times but I was specifically thinking of in the song dance till we die how she said her daughter is going to be named Clementine so I made a bracelet that says Clementine and I used just white and orange beads <laughs> and I have another favorite that I'm gonna save this one is another Ethel Kane one this says this is from her song Crush Low Slug Bad Bitch and I have This is like the first bracelet I did where I like actually knew kind of what I was doing. Although I don't like that I used the flat bead, the flat beads in the spaces. But this is a boy genius themed bracelet. And it says, Will you be a Satanist with me? And that's obviously from their song Satanist. I'm gonna save this one. This one's another favorite. This one is too big that I made. Um, it actually fits my dad's wrist, but not mine. This is my favorite Lana Del Rey song. This is Terrence loves you. I use just way too many beads for this, and that's my Um, yeah. <laughs> this is another Ethel Kane bracelet. This is her song. Televangelism. And I have a similar color theme. I have like a cyan, a pink, and white beads. This 
is one of my favorite Lana Del Rey songs. This is How to Disappear. Imagine the video just ended. <laughs> and I have these, I think they're orange beads, but they look kind of red here. But these are orange beads. Um, this is one that my mom made. I'm not gonna show you guys, because I'm not- this video is not me showing you guys bracelets my mom made. It's showing you bracelets I made. Um, this is another Ethel King one. This one's also a little bit big. But this was the first one I did with all small beads, so I wasn't exactly sure about the sizing. And this is her EP and the song, Golden E. one's a good one. This is another boy genius bracelet. This says... <laughs> this says $20 with a smiley face. If you know the song $20 by Boy Genius, you know it's like $20. May I please have $20? This is the first bracelet that I tried to make but failed miserably like four times but eventually I was able to do it and get it right and this one I made for my mom because her favorite Taylor Swift song is ready for it so I said are you it has a harder time focusing on the black beads And then I just have black and orange beads. Or, sorry, just orange beads in the spaces. These are, these are black beads. But I also decorated with them, so I guess that counts. This is Lana Del Rey song and album. This is... Oh, getting these all to face the same way is really annoying. <laughs> um... Is a little smudgy. That makes it. it wasn't even smudgy before, I don't know. And then again, I have those holographic black beads. This one I just made a few days ago. This one is one of my favorite Lana Del Rey songs. That is Bitch. And then I have these blue. One is another one of my favorite Lana Del Rey songs. This is Fishtail. And I have brown and pink in the spaces. And then two different shades of blue. But you can't tell that it's two different shades of blue on camera. And then white and yellow beads in the spaces. It's another favorite. I'll save it for the end. This is. Sorry. <laughs> my nose is itchy. This is. This one is another Lana Del Rey bracelet. This one says violet. Because that's a word common in other songs. You have violets for roses. The lyric from Cinema Girl, violet, blue, green, with a dinky at arm's length. Um, I'm sure there's others that I can't think of for some reason. But yeah, and then I just have these big boom beads. 
this one is another Ethel Kane bracelet. This says, I keep praying. And this is from her song, Sunblazed Flies. Great song. I just have this nice white bead as a space. This one is a funny one. This one says, it's another Lana Del Rey one. And this says, I think I'm trying to get it to focus. This is Lanita. I'm trying to get it to focus. Oh, it's not going to focus. And this is just a gold one because from the song Taco Truck XVB in the Taco Truck part, she says, I made a gold chain that says Lanita. So that was funny. Um, this is another Ethel Kane one. This just says Daughter of Kane. That's like what her fan base, I guess, is called. But also, it's part of the lore of the Preacher's Daughter album. And then in the song Ptolemaea, it said, Blessed be the daughters of Kane. So I just thought. camera's just not gonna focus today, I guess. And this one, I tried so hard to make this look cool, but the phrase I had on here was too long, so the concept kind of just went. This is a boy genius one from their song, Catch em ID or Catch em Idaho. Um, the lyric is two, oh, this one focuses really well, two yellow tight ropes. Um, and so I tried to make, tried to make, um, it was a very difficult bracelet to make. It took an hour and it doesn't even look that good. Um, another favorite that I'm going to save. Another favorite that I'm going to save. I'm getting towards the end of this, I promise. This is one my mom made for me. You can't look at it. This is one that I made for my friend. I'm um, not going to show you because the artist at this festival that I'm going to for the one that this bracelet is, it's like that artist is related to that one. Um, they're not going to be at that festival anymore, so I'm not going to show you. This one is another Lana one. Um, I kind of made this for my mom, but also I kind of made it for myself. Um, this is one of my favorite. I know it's like so popular, but it's also so underrated amongst the fandom. Um, this is an Ethel Kane one. I don't really like this bracelet that much. Because again, I used the flat beads as spaces. Um, but I have like pink, red, and purple, and I like just kind of the thing. And then it says black eye and two kisses from her song crush i have you a black eye and two kisses you should go make that up yes, silly. this is another boy genius one there's a lot of noise happening it's pissing me off um i just got a mirror today so i can't close my bedroom door all the way right now because it's a door hanging mirror Anyways, so, this is another Boy Genius one, and this is one of my favorite songs of theirs. This is Revolution Zero. Yes, this is a zero, not an O. I bought number, bra number beads, like, last week. And I just have these, like, blue-gray beads. And then yellow in the spaces. Well, actually, it's just, just one space. Um, this one is too big. This is another Lana Del Rey one. This is Million Dollar Man. And I just used, like, these blue and clear beads. 
because it's one of my favorite Taylor Swift songs. This is Closure. Very underrated song. Um, and I used gold, red, black, and green beans. The last one before I show you guys my few favorites that I saved. So this is from it's another Lana Del Rey one. This is soft ice cream. And I used these pink and off-white beads and that deal. And this is from the song Salvador from the Honey Moon album. She also says it in another, she also says soft ice cream. I want to say it's from like off to the races or Carmen or something, but I'm not sure. Anyways, speaking of Carmen, my first favorite, these are not in particular order, is Carmen. Just a classic blue and white and then red Born to Die album cover. Carmen was like my one of my first favorite songs off of Born to Die. Born to Die is not my favorite Lana album like at all but in the past like month it's like really started to grow on me a lot I like it a lot more than I did this is another Lana one this says you're just a man this is from the NFR title track Norman fucking Rockwell and so I just have all these colors I have green blue red black and white and yeah, I really like this one. It just like fits really nicely. I just think it's cool. And also, you know, you're just a man. It's just what you do. Um, this is a Taylor Swift one. This is Cardigan. And I have these off. I think these are the white beads, not the off white beads. And blue. And then I have silver and gold in the spaces. Um, another Taylor Swift one. This is one of my favorite songs of hers. This, I think it's my most streamed Taylor Swift song, at least recently. Um, and this is Glitch. And so I'm a very, like, I like to stick to patterns, but for this one I was like, okay, well, since it's Glitch, there can't be a pattern. It has to be sporadic. So it's mostly purple, but then we got, oops, there's orange. Oops, there's blue. Oops, there's yellow. Oh no, blue, yellow. Oh no, there's black and another orange and a white one. And another white one and a black one. I don't know. Um, okay, we have four more bracelets, guys. This is another Lana Del Rey one. This is obviously her song, Cinnamon Girl. And there's a slight pat error in the bead pattern and it drives me crazy but I have just these dark pink and light pink ones and then a dark pink and light pink of the little beads and I just think this one's really like unique and pretty okay the rest of these are all Lana Del Rey this one is another favorite this one's from her song Bartender so underrated um this is Cherry and then Coke. And I have cherry Coke colors. I have like a dark red and a brown. And then I just have little black beads in the space. And yeah, this is just one of my favorites. I should have worn it today because it like matches my outfit. But I've been wearing this one a lot recently. Okay. Two more bracelets. Holy shit, this is a long video. Um, this is another one of the Rice song. Like I said, the rest are Lana Del Rey. This is my favorite, like, song title of all time. This is Tulsa Jesus Freak. It's just such a good song title. And then so I have gold and silver beads in all of the spaces, as you can see right here. Um, and then just green. And then this is my favorite bracelet that I've ever made because it's just so stunning. This is from the Lana Del Rey song, Finger 
Um, my throat's starting to hurt from talking for so long. And yeah, I love.